hello my lovely people welcome back to my channel i greet you according to your time and the time you are seeing this video we are still on the gist from the palace of Oni of ife okay oh allegedly uh, we are hearing that an old man have exposed the reason why women don't last with the king Oni of ife and what must be done okay oh well, let's just take a little look at uh, the women that have been in his life before now Okay, they said before he became the king that he married a woman named Adebisi Adebunkola Bombata. The woman, they also call her Bukola or Buki. She, he married this woman in 2007. That was when he, uh, he had not become the king. So, however, the story of uh, Oni of Ife and the woman's marriage is not a happy one. Yes, it's not a happy one. So, according to what we are hearing, you know, they said uh, Bukola could not bear the king a child. And when he became the king, for the fact that Bukola did not give him any child, they said uh, they did not make her the official queen. And they reduced her to a commoner. You can imagine that. Okay, well, according to what we are hearing, they said that Bukola did not even stick around that coronation, that, that did not stick around after coronation. They claimed that she flew to UK straight away after the ceremony. Apparently because they said Bukola and her husband, Oni Ofife, got into a fight and she slapped him in front of his own father. And this is what they said, it is highly inappropriate and unforgivable. And that was why they said their marriage ended. So you see, uh, from the beginning, it did not start from when Naomi and the rest of these women. So secondly, after that one, he got married to uh, Wurola. And the marriage with Wurola lasted about 17 months. According to what we are hearing, you know, they said they were accusing Wurola of infidelity. And I was like, how can Wurola be having an extramarital affair when they said he did this uh, traditional stuff that is still keeping with Naomi up to date with Wurola? And according to what we are hearing allegedly, they said once they do that uh, traditional covenant, that the woman cannot meet with another man. So how then do you think Wurola would be uh, sleeping with another man under uh, the king's uh, uh, building? So I don't think that is the main problem. So according to this, okay, it was a letter after Wurola's marriage with the king that lasted for 17 months ended that he got married to when naomi and let's not just paint it here they said ever since when naomi enters that palace she have been facing problems you know one gang up women attack on and all of that that is because the king cannot hold his stain very tight the king always bring in uh women concubines and all of that even when he promised the uh, he promised queen naomi that there will be no polygamy and all of that and as it is now it is all these honoris that uh join force with the king to destroy his marriage with queen naomi that he later married and they are the ones in the palace now why queen naomi is out of the palace so this issue of not uh, being able to keep a marriage did not start with Queen Naomi. And I don't think it is going to end with Queen Naomi unless what this man said uh, is done. Because according to this man, he said that this issue of a woman not lasting with the king did not start with uh, Queen Naomi. And unless the king is ready to find out what exactly is the cause of it, that unless he finds out the cause of this problem, that that is the only way that it can be uh, solved. Because one thing is certain, you know, after all these things, if nothing is done about it, definitely Queen Naomi will go. And not just that she will go. You see all these women with all these their buzzbows and everything they do to be in that palace, for the fact that that thing is still working. 
they cannot last. They cannot last with the king. Before you know it, they will start going off because they will not get what they want. And that same spirit that has been making women not to last with him will still be at work. And when all of them left, he will still marry others unless he's weak and tired. Maybe when he must have gotten old. And with all this drama, he might not have children from the people he married. Because from what we are hearing, it is only Queen Naomi who is able to give him a child among the women that he married. The, one, the other children that he has are from his concubines. And you can imagine that a man that marries up to seven wives, only one of it gave one of the women gave him a child. And he's not bothered. So my people, they said this man said a lot of things concerning the king. That it's not all about how to nag. That king knows how to nag very well. It's not about uh, good behavior. He's a, a good child. But there is spirit somewhere that is fighting his marital life. If you ask me, I would say maybe the king have spiritual wife. <laughs> Sorry to say it though. But these are the kind of things that can make a man not to last uh, or not to, uh, to be unable to keep a woman physically. Because we do know that all the soloris that gather themselves in the palace, they are the ones keeping themselves. If they look at the king to be the one to keep them in that marriage, they will not be there. So you see, uh, the main problem here is that he has not identified his major problem. And the moment the main problem is identified, that is when uh, the uh, problem will be solved. And you will see that they will come back. And if you ask me or somehow, maybe Queen Naomi is the one who is destined to help him destroy that. And that is why they were able to give him a, an heir through, the, through Queen Naomi. But the problem is that, I don't know. The problem is that that thing that is still doing this thing will not let him know that there is a problem. Because we do know that for someone to solve his problem, first of all, he has to identify or accept that there is a problem. Because when you don't accept that there is a problem, you cannot be looking for solution to that problem. So let's just hope that what this man said allegedly is the main thing. And let's just also hope that he will... Uh, try to find out what exactly the problem is so that he will be able to solve it. If not, when Naomi will go, all these other ones will go and others will still come and go. Barak still remain. <laughs> My people, oh, don't be smart. And don't forget that they are all alleged information because I don't even know the man in question and I do not live in the palace. That is what we saw. Like I told you, anything I see or hear about the king, I will come and update you. Okay, so I saw this one. I thought I should come and share with you. Don't forget that they are all alleged information. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Love you guys.